Hello. It's uh, raining, so I'm under the sort of back porch there, next to the, uh, let's see, uh, maybe the rate of the rain on the rain chain. And it's uh, pretty gloomy and gray. I uh, just received word that a uh, um, teacher of many teachers I know has passed away. Went into hospice yesterday and uh, just left this plane very, very, very short time ago. So uh, I've lit a candle for a seafood look. I don't know if you can see it. And, uh, kind of felt appropriate to leave the candle out here in the rain. Even though I know in this wind and rain, it's not very all, all that very likely to stay lit. But I also brewed uh, some Xintao Jia. This is the uh, peach tea, it's the peach of immortality, the peach of long life, which uh, seemed to be the right thing to do. So I came out here to practice a little standing. I'm going to do a little standing set that I learned from Sifu Look, or just, uh, I think, just one posture, uh, and uh, maybe talk a little bit about them. Uh, I'm looking for a place to uh, set the uh, camera phone. I guess I can call it a camera. That's how it's being used. That seems okay. Yeah. So, Xin Tao. I think it's a up Tao. Xin Tao. Xin Tao. I think that's right. Ciao. So, uh, I'll set the tea down on the porch. Nope, I won't take it there. I'll stand it over here. And uh, I'll bring the candle into frame. And, uh, I don't know. You know. Yeah, you can't see it there. I mean, it probably won't stay here. But we can try. Why not? And, uh, I think I'm gonna. I was thinking today I might do a little meditation with the rain and listening. Uh, so, kind of one of the thoughts I was having as I was working out earlier in the rain. Uh, now, with this news, uh, kind of throwing things into question. I'm just gonna. Do a little embrace around the falling rain. So a super look for me. Calls to mind Nick and Lynn. Calls to mind the dog, Rick Clark, the McIntyres, calls to mind Randy Sugarawa, Sugarawa, calls to mind Valerie, Gable, Prince Gable, calls to mind Larry, Calls to mind Dave Cater. Calls to mind Jonathan Donovan. Randy Aaliyah. Calls to mind Nina Sugoro. An interesting quality, a legacy. No idea if you can hear me, but the wind and the rain and the distance. And then into the posture we got to learn from him. 
in San Diego. And there's a mountain lion on the roof and a pool at the center. Last time I saw a seafood look, you know, there's 60 people in the room, 50 people in the room, all practicing, all working out, and he was, you know, rather frail and quiet and sitting, not exactly teaching, other people were teaching, and he was observing, but sort of physically still, seemingly tired, perhaps in pain, and he watched, you know, like a weekend's worth of people practicing and different teachers offering corrections and their thing. And he had nothing to offer, by which I mean he didn't interrupt or get up to say or do anything. Until some period towards the end where he, with a fair amount of struggle, worked himself up, worked up his volume, brought over somebody to get everybody's attention. And, and he said, listen, listen. And then he sat, and that was, you know, the whole weekend, and that was his only instruction, which could seem very little, <laughs> but it could also seem like a very grand, a grand thing. But, you know, is there a more appropriate lesson from somebody named Look than Listen? Sure. Yeah, sorry, the phone rang and I don't know if it kept going. But in the whole weekend full of people that were experienced martial artists, working on their martial arts with great instructors present. Oh, and Paul Rossignol was there too. <laughs> and uh, like the only words, the only thing he felt needed to be reminded Hey, Saki. How you doing, buddy? Are you out in the rain? Come here. Yeah, here's the kitty that's been standing out in the rain. How you doing, buddy? And he thought the thing that he wanted to remind people of, and I don't think it stems from his watching us thinking we particularly were lacking, but it was the thing he cared enough to emphasize. And it took a fair amount of effort for him. He got up and he said, listen, listen and then sat and I thought boy here's this great lesson on Ting Chin I mean about as simple as it can be yeah are you getting pretty good in the rain here we go I'm going to sit you down okay here we go so I just set Saki down on the set set Saki down on the well So now, when I think of Sifu Look, I don't just think of Dave Cater and Doug and Randy and Valerie and Nick and Lynn and the Sugawaras and Larry. Uh, you know, I think of listening. I think of Tingjin. So uh, the rain is now put out the candle, but uh, the spark remains alive.